His Excellency Bobby Wines Camp, NUP, through the spokesperson Honorable Joel Senyonyi and the Secretary General David Luis Rubonkoya have responded to the Minister of Internal Affairs, General Kahinda Otafide, who yesterday said Bobby Wine and other opposition leaders while in Kenya last month paraded victims of border border accidents as victims of torture and accused President Museveni's government to be behind it. <laughs> wasiku boda boda baba kwa ne wagende mulago ne wavayo katwaro baruwa baba limba ne watwara ibweru ne waraga esiyo na ne wateka masoga mbada mauli ne ntabano batulugudizibwa mulabide bisago bya ebyaba tuka ko kati ne mbanta okoleto byamu esiyo rufwe General Otafide has ordered that investigations into this matter should be commenced as soon as possible so that Bobby Wine and group can be prosecuted on treason charges. Ngambia director wa criminal intelligence aba goberere orumara kufuna mawulire aga wekure director wa CID wa CID abatwali mchi mukoti eh abatwali mukoti kwanga tosobala kugenda mitara ya mwama wanga nokora gara ne government ze bweru now, Honorable Joel Senyonyi, the spokesperson of NUP, said there's no lie in whatever happened at the Human Rights Conference in Kenya, claiming that all the people that were paraded to the public is true. Their bodies were harmed by President Museveni's government. Even other people, according to Joel Senyonyi, have been killed by President Museveni's government. <laughs> Katiboze baita accident, na inga zari ngeendelele mwuduka za polisi na amaji, nga zari tumira avantu wano, nga zichi ngeendelele. Banondo mwuna, kituwa kwa za katuonda anti, baina visago na yete baafa. Tuina abu, abafa, Frank Sendeza, ya tumirwa e motoka ya amaji na afa. Ruita nabu kenye mwuduka ya polisi ya mutomira, chikendele wali nakawa kubitala. Fred nanga ya baina agama, jine dasi mwuduka ya polisi, infakta walo kamera za CCTV, mbubaja kufurumia akatambi yako. Nkira Fredi nanga ya vayena agama ya mkasera, accident uwe ya vede lao, CCTV kamerazi, mkasera ako, zari zifude. So kakati jemi utafili na abanga lukujulizi. Ukujulizi ya umu, mbuji mikonu java ntunga Fredi nanga. Iranga tuwa galo uwe nkanya, uwaba ntuwa no, ni familia za abu. Now, NUP Secretary General David Luis Rubonkoya said there are reports on all the cases that were taken to Kenya, and so they are ready to face government in the courts of law if General Kahindo Tafire says so. statement. We confirming that we are going to be asking Mr. Mulumuye. That is why we are here. We are going to hear about the fact that we are going to be misinformed. Well, in other news. Buganda Kingdom, through the Deputy Katikro Wagwa Sivirwa, has called upon President Museveni's government to stop abducting people, but rather use the lawful ways to handle criminals and take them to the courts of law, but not just keeping them in detention centers. Kwanga inesindi, e inaba kozi, e inaba kumadembe. Na ye ensanji zinechokuwa ataba antu, atene vata tuwaliba mbuga za mateka kuhu wakobu julizi. Mewasi wogu siruwa, enkore yu tujivume zi. Nyo tuna agenda wetu kyo, ataba antu, badja kwecha wa. Ataba antu, badja kweta mwa. Kuliza government, ewe ya ufunanyi ziwa. Ataba antu wakole milimu jabwe, bafu nonyeleze, bagendo kutuuntu wala. Nga baino ujulizi, Eravanti mbuga za mateka. 
the leader of opposition in parliament, Right Honorable Mathas Mbuga, has declined to submit another list of abducted and missing persons as requested by government. Well, in a meeting that was held yesterday with uh, the Deputy Speaker of Parliament, Honorable Thomas Tayebua, and uh, the Prime Minister, Robina Nambanja, among others, Mbuga told them to go back and retrieve the four lists that had been submitted in the past few months. <laughs> Well, there you go. That is uh, the latest update I got for you right here on the Bazuji. And uh, in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fula, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.